Let's look at some of the ways to use the label propagation algorithm in Neuler to categorize groups of nodes based upon their relationships in the graph and the weights of their relationships. We have selected the community detection group of algorithms. We select the label propagation algorithm. We want to create LPA values for the person nodes that are connected by the helps relationship. At this point, we don't care about relationship direction, and we will not use any weights for the relationships. We leave the remaining settings with their default values. Now we run the algorithm. Here are the table results. Notice that this algorithm has identified two communities, one with two nodes and one with four nodes. And when we view the visualization, we see that each community is represented by a different color. In Neuler, during your session, it keeps a history of the algorithms that you have run. You can navigate to them here. Or, if you are in a particular view for the running of an algorithm, if you select the configuration, you can click Edit Configuration to modify what you last used for running that algorithm. Suppose we select the natural relationship orientation, meaning that the direction of the relationship is significant. When we run the algorithm, we see that the visualization is different because we are using direction as a qualifier. Next, we return to the previous configuration and click Edit Configuration again to select the weight property to be weight. When we run the algorithm, we see a different result because we are using relationship direction and weight to determine the grouping. Here is the generated code for setting the parameters, running the algorithm, and retrieving the nodes. And finally, we can generate the browser guide for this algorithm and copy it to Neo4j browser. This concludes our look at how to run the label propagation algorithm and how changing parameters will influence the LPA property that is written to the nodes.